what's up lovely people welcome back to tamara's recipes today guys we're gonna be making some delicious jamaican pumpkin punch in my kitchen so keep on watching these are the ingredients that i will be using for the punch i have a little over a pound of pumpkin that i cut in some big pieces as i can see i have my dragon stout i have my vanilla my sweetened condensed milk i have this is about three tablespoons of instant oats i have some freshly grated nutmeg i have cinnamon powder and a pinch of salt the instant oats is optional but i like to add it to mine so if you don't want to add it you can always leave out the oats so guys if you like it can you always use a supergen and nutriment but i don't have a lot of dairy so that's why i'm just using the condensed milk here I have some hot water on the stove, so what I'm going to do now is to add the pumpkin. Then I'm going to cover the pot and let it cook. Just let it cook for about 10 to 15 minutes or until the pumpkin is far tender. So as you can see they are really soft you don't even have to test it you can just look at them so what i'm going to do now is i'm going to allow them to cool down completely before i proceed to make the punch so guys i'm adding my cooled pumpkin into the blender also i'm going to be adding like a cup of the juice of the pumpkin water yes that has a lot of nutrients so you know we don't want to leave that out now I'm going to be adding my instant oats I'm gonna be adding my spices also I'm going to be adding my two teaspoon of vanilla I can add one but I love to use vanilla So now I'm going to cover the blender. So the mixture is finished blending, so I'm just going to test to see how thick it is. So here is my dragon, I'm going to add about a half. So if you like, you can always change your container, but I don't like a lot of mess, so I'm just going to be using the blender. I'm going to add my sweetened condensed milk. So you add it to your taste. So I added about a half of the can. Ensure that you mix it very well. So after you mix it, you're going to taste it. Unless you guys want to taste it and need more alcohol, so I'm going to be adding the whole bottle. And also I'm going to add a little bit more of the condensed milk. I don't like my mixture sweet and I don't like it too thick. So this amount of condensed milk is just fine. So if you want yours to be very thick, you can add as much pumpkin and oats as you like. Just going to give it another mix. So if you like, you can always use cold dragon to blend yours and use some ice cubes. So now I'm going to plate 
Now I'm going to pour my mixture into my glass jar. So guys, I have some ice in my glass, so I'm going to pour some juice. So there you have it guys, this is how I make Jamaican pumpkin and oat sponge in my kitchen. Thank you so much for watching. Please remember to like, share, comment and subscribe to my channel for more videos. See you next time. Bye bye.